Andre Fialo is a 14-3 welterweight born in Cascais, Portugal, now fighting out of Deerfield Beach, Florida with Sanford MMA. The 27-year-old has some Hulk in those hands, 11 of 14 wins by KO and 9 in the very first round. He has only lost to present or past UFC fighters and will step in on short notice for an Octagon debut on the main card at UFC 270. Fialo currently rides a four fight finish streak and this is how it started. From January 2021 facing former UFC ranked lightweight 13-5 James the Texecutioner Vic. The 6'3 34 year old is now looking for new life at welterweight. Early round two, Andre catches him with a counter left hook. Short strike still wobbles Vic, then Fialo presses down on the gas pedal. Opponent's head movement is gone with the wind. Seconds later, Vic still searching for some clarity, gets drilled by an uppercut, then another for good measure. Left to the body by Andre in the mix hurts opponent, and one final flurry ends it. Andre Fialo makes easy work of the UFC veteran, scoring a second round stoppage to take his record to 11 and 3. Before this fight, he was 0 2 and 1, no contest due to an opponent's positive steroid test. Fialo came out hesitant tonight, understandably, but found the counter shots he was searching all fight for in the second round and quickly doubled down. Next fight five months later in Abu Dhabi to face the Korean assassin 6-1 Sang Hoon Yu. The 32-year-old is a 2019 Dana White's Contender Series veteran, but lost a unanimous decision so Dana White elevator ejected him out of the apex like Dr. Evil. Start of round one, first strike Fialo throws, ends in a knockdown. Andre circles his prey, feeding ground strikes till the ref steps in between. All over in 18 whole seconds, short left hook just a little faster than you, who is throwing the same exact strike. Andre Fialo has that unique knockout power, took only one strike to hurt his opponent. That is his ninth stoppage from strikes in the first and fastest ever finish, beating a 29 second KO from 2016. Three months later, staying in the desert for a matchup against 10-3 Lincoln Puig. The young Brazilian lost last time out, but before that, three finishes including a rare Bravo choke. The submission specialist might have something for Fialo tonight. Midway past round one, Fialo getting his jabs going, then faints the left looking for power uppercuts off that jab. Minute later, Puig opening up gets caught. Left hook hurts him. Andre looking for the kill shot along the cage line. Seconds gone now, all Puig can do is cover up. Fialo smells blood in the water and moves in with his short strikes, hooks, and uppercuts end his night. More knockouts in round one for the Portuguese Panther. Now Andre is 13-3 with three straight stoppages. All his early finishes are even more impressive considering his cautious fight style. He likes to take his time finding his counter shots, but when Fialo does, put those air raid sirens on quick, cause bombs will be dropping. Final fight before the UFC slid in his DMs. From October 2021, facing former UFC welterweight 14-4 Stefan Sekulic. 0-2 in the octagon but lost to Ramazan Emiv, who everybody loses a decision to, and a split to Dwight the Body Snatcher Grant. Good competition, tough results, but now a winner of his last two. Early first Sekulic working on a single leg, but Fialo has other plans. Slashing elbow on the button knocks him clean out. Andre Fialo gets a KO off one leg. 
This man definitely has some legendary power, and opponent Sekulich had only been finished once before by present UFC welterweight David Savara. After four straight KO stoppages, Andre Fialo debuts against fan favorite 26 and 11 Michel Pereira on short notice at UFC 270. Gone versus Inganu.